part by Dr. J's Hot Hand and by your Nissan dealer. Wake up to Geraldo, weekday mornings at 9 on Channel 2. I'm Oliver Taylor from Seton Hall University. If it seems like I'm in a rush, that's because I only have a few seconds to make my points. You gotta get one up, only four to go. Taylor into the lane, up, scoop shot, oh, shot! Even if I seem rushed, believe me, there's always plenty of time. Six seconds, Taylor now on the drive. <laughs> Trying to be the hero again, he does yes! Now you get a chance to see what we can do in a whole 40 minute game. Our first on the road to the final four. Hello, everyone. I'm Andrea Joyce, along with Mike Francesa. Welcome to CBS Sports exclusive coverage of the 1991 NCAA Championship Tournament. We will be with you here all day today and tomorrow. Jim Nance and Billy Packer will anchor our primetime tournament coverage tonight and tomorrow night, as well as throughout the weekend. And Mike, as always, this is the time when we turn to you for the big picture. You know, we've been on the road to the Final Four so long. Now we can finally get in that left lane, step on the gas. 32 games in two days. 48 and four will be discarding teams along the way. I'm going to fasten my seatbelt along with yours. All right, for now, we are about to get underway with 64 teams sharing a single dream. We'll try to show you as much of the action as we possibly can. And here's our game plan. We have done our best to select the games with the best interests of the local areas, but we will be here monitoring all the action. And whenever it heats up, we'll take you out there, even if it means missing a couple of baskets at the start of one game in order to catch the live finish of another. So rest assured that if Oliver Taylor of Seton Hall, whom you saw at the beginning of the program, gets the ball in the final few seconds. We will, of course, do our best to take you out there live. And, of course, we will come up with a couple of air balls, but uh, we'll do our best to make it a high percentage shot before we switch you around. In any event, we promise you plenty of action and plenty of fun. So the road to the final four starts now with eight first-round sites, four today and four tomorrow. In the east today, we will be at Cole Field House outside Washington, D.C., on the campus of the University of Maryland. First round action in the southeast today will be at Freedom Hall in Louisville, where Muhammad Ali made his professional debut. In the Midwest, play gets underway at the Hubert H. Humphrey Metrodome, site of next year's Final Four and the Super Bowl. And out west, the action unwinds at the Special Events Center in Salt Lake City, Utah. And here are your first game matchups. Most of you will see Northeast Louisiana with slam dunk artist Anthony Jones against Duke and its big man Christian Leitner. They're certainly no strangers to the Final Four. Down in the Southeast, Pittsburgh playmaker Sean Miller leads the Panthers of the Big East against the Bulldogs of Georgia in Louisville. And here in the East, Oklahoma State's Byron Houston, the Big 8 co-player of the year, leads Eddie Sutton's squad against New Mexico. And Mike, New Mexico has waited an awfully long time to get to the NCAA tournament. They have Dave Bliss taking his third different team to the Final Four. Eddie Sutton, a record fourth team, to, I mean, not to the Final Four, to the tournament. Eddie Sutton, his fourth team to the tournament with Oklahoma State. And Latero Green will not start for Georgia today. Broken finger on his left hand, will play, will not start. All right, now coming up next, Georgia and Pittsburgh. For those of you scheduled to watch Northeast Louisiana against Duke, your tip time is 12.35, and while you're waiting, we'll let you watch the start of Georgia Pitt. And those of you slated for New Mexico and Oklahoma State, stay with us as the road to the Final Four continues exclusively here on CBS. And, Mike, very quickly, your Final Four picks. Okay, UNLV, North Carolina, Indiana, and a surprise, a team a lot of people won't even, doesn't, don't even think will win tonight, LSU. All right, we will be back after a word from your local station.